Good morning! Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna do a what I eat in my life. What I eat in my life. I gotta start this over. I'm so tired. I just woke up. Love that I'm starting this video like this. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a what I eat in a day video. So I'm starting it bright and early. It is 7.07. .07. I am about to um, have my coffee and eat my little breakfast and I'm gonna go to the gym and get my day going. And I literally just woke up, which is why I look so fab right now. This is me. <laughs> So I cannot drink my coffee black. I think it's so gross. I wish I could. I like to put sugar-free French vanilla in and I find that this doesn't spike my blood sugar at all. I don't take any insulin for it. See, so yeah, it has one carb per tablespoon and I honestly don't put a lot in here. I just put a little bit in, so let me do that now. Just enough. I fixed my hair a little bit. Um, I should say I woke up at 1.20 uh, in the 1.20, so I'm really happy with that. I was a little high before I went to bed. I was like, I'm going up because I ate a before bed snack because I was going low. So I'm really happy with that. Um, looks like I was pretty stable overnight, but let me look and see if I actually was. Oh yeah. So I averaged about, I was basically in the 120s all night, which I'm really happy about. I'm gonna drink my coffee and then eat my like real food, but I like to, this is how I do things. I drink my coffee and then I like eat real food. For some reason I can't do both at the same time. I don't know if it's because they're both like warm and I feel like I need to drink cold water with my regular food, I don't know. So again, not taking any insulin with my coffee. Um, I usually go to the gym as soon as I'm done eating in the morning at about like eight o'clock, 8.30, I think I might get there. I don't have my glasses on so I can't see what time it is. I think I'm gonna get there a little early this morning which will be kinda nice. Oh, there's my alarm going on. So I don't take any insulin for anything that I eat because I like to be going up a little bit. Um, what I tend to do at the gym is 30 minutes of cardio and 30 minutes of like, machines or weights or whatever um so i get a little like mix of both that's that i'll keep you guys updated on my blood sugars and what i'm eating today i should also say i've been watching my calories um just because i'm really trying to get like healthy um i feel like i've neglected my health in the past not diabetes wise i've really taken care of my diabetes but i haven't really been watching what i'm eating watching my calorie intake all that stuff so i've been using my fitness pal and just trying to make sure I eat a good amount of calories every day. I should also say I've been trying to get 10,000 steps in every day. Um, usually I just make it over the 10,000 mark, but I do do it. I've been going to the mall, becoming a mall walker like, like a crazy person. Um, but I've realized because it's winter here right now, it's still, is it still January or February? Okay, it's January 30th. Um, yeah, I've been going to the mall and like walking around inside the mall at night and just making sure that I get all my steps in. I also try and drink a bunch of these throughout the day. They are like 28 ounces. I usually drink at least one, sometimes two before I go to the gym. It feels so good after drinking coffee because coffee dehydrates you if you didn't know that. So I'm gonna fill one of these up while I get my breakfast out of the fridge. Not while I do it. I'm gonna fill this up and then get my breakfast out of the fridge. I'm also going to grab a straw to stick in it because I find I drink it way quicker with a straw, especially a bigger straw like this um, as compared to a straw like this that's very small. So you can't even see it. So yeah, this is my key to drinking water is a large, nice straw. I got these on Amazon. I will link them below. This doesn't have anything to do with the content of this video today, but just look how pretty the sun looks coming in. The sun, my throat just made a weird noise. The sun's coming up right now and it looks so pretty on my neighbor's house who I've never even met, but let me show you. Oh, morning light. Now I'm like, is it weird that I just filmed my neighbor's house? I don't think so. I don't know them. Um, but I think it's fine. So for breakfast, I am, I made these low carb like breakfast cookies, breakfast muffins. I really don't know what you would call them. Um, they have breakfast sausage, cream cheese, eggs, cheese, 
coconut flour and baking powder in it. I think that's it. I'll link the recipe below. Um, I don't have it categorized by like lunch, breakfast, dinner, breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks. Um, but I love these. They are like no carbs. Um, they're low calories and they fill me up. And I usually, if I eat like one of these, I'm good until lunchtime at like 12, 30, 1 o'clock. So sometimes I have a snack though, but that's okay. So this is just what they look like and I just throw it in the microwave for about 45 seconds to a minute. Finished my first cup of this so I'm going to fill it up again while I get ready for the gym and try and drink that super fast and then I will be off to the gym. Okay, I'm pretty much ready for the gym. I just, um, I put my contacts in, pull my hair up, wipe my face off. I'm gonna take my insulin and a little snack just in case I go low, and I'm also gonna fill up a water bottle, which is right there. I was gonna grab a little extra low snack, but I think one, this will be fine. It's a little fig thing. Um, and two, I have some in my car and in my bag. They're all over. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the gym now. I'm actually earlier ready than I normally am. Usually I go to the gym at like 8.15, 8.20, and it's 7.52, so mm, having a good day. You guys, oh my god, it's so cold out. Oh, a cop's driving by me. It's so cold out. I mean, I'm parked. I'm not driving. I just get weird. Um, it's so cold out. This coat is not heavy enough. Oh, I have my heat on, but... It's cold right now because I literally just got in my car and I'm just freaking cold. Okay, I'm gonna go drive to the gym and get warm and do all that stuff. Oh, my blood sugar right now because I think it'll go up a little bit. I think, I hope. Okay, maybe not. It's 122. It hasn't really gone anywhere. Um, I might have to eat the other half of that fig thing that I have stuffed in my bag. Now I'm kind of glad I have it. Unless I just took it out and left it in my house. Oh, it's in there. Um, okay, going to the gym now. Sun in my eyeballs. I'm at the gym now. Um, my blood sugar is 125. So I'm gonna have a tiny snack. Um, half of that fig thing is like 19 carbs. Um, so I'm gonna have that because the first thing I do is 30 minutes of cardio on the bike. And then I do 30 or so minutes of like strength training, weightlifting, I don't know what you call it. So I'm gonna do that um, because cardio usually drops me and I don't have any insulin on board, but I'm also not going up. So I'm gonna do that super fast and go into the gym right after. I'm not gonna take any insulin for it. Um, I'm not gonna take you guys into the gym with me because I'm scared straight up, but um, Maybe I'll film on my phone. I just don't want to like film people. I feel like that's really uncomfortable. So, okay. I'm gonna eat my thing now. <laughs> I just got done with the gym. I am cruising. Didn't ever take any insulin. I didn't really even spike. Look at that. This is why I love MDI. Like, d I, I, j I have no words, obviously. Um, so I'm gonna go home now and take a shower and start working and do all that stuff. It's 9.30 now. Um, I'll basically just up you guys up. <laughs> update you guys if I eat anything. I'm now deciding if this is like a day in the life video, slash a vlog, slash a what I eat in a day, maybe a combo of all three. I don't know, but I'm feeling good. I'm not hungry. Sometimes I get a little hungry on the way home, but I think my mind is just like, oh, what are you gonna do now? Like, we're gonna make you hungry. I think my mind plays tricks on me. So, I'm gonna go home now. All right. <laughs> I just got home from the gym. Um, I am going to have some collagen. I have this every day. I usually drink it while I'm in the shower. It is integrated supplements. I get it at Target. It's honestly really good. It's a mixed berry flavor. 
it's good for your hair and your nails and my nails are actually really gross right now i need to like paint them or something so yeah so i'm just gonna do this mix this up and then jump in the shower it's also time i should say to take my long acting insulin so i'm gonna do that really quick I'm gonna take a shower now and then I will see you guys when I'm done. I just got out of the shower. I am 117, so kind of going up a little bit still, but I'm not gonna do anything yet. I'm not getting anything right now, even though I'm like a little hungry. It's like almost 11. I say it's almost 11, it's like 10.30. Um, so I'm just gonna do some work right now and then try and make it to lunch without eating anything because my biggest weakness is snacking. So if I can not snack in the morning, um, then I feel like I did a good job. I should also say while I'm waiting for my computer to come back to life, I, whoop, I am drinking another huge thing of water. I'm 139 with a diagonal arrow up, so I'm gonna take a little bit of insulin right now. Um, basically this happened yesterday and I never really came back down like on my own. So I'm gonna take some insulin to kind of get ahead of this high um, or this blood sugar before it goes too much higher. I think I'm gonna take Fiasp um, because that will, oh, I have like sack electricity all over me. That will work quicker, here it is over here, than no vlog. By the way, I don't know if you've noticed this, but I'm really trying hard to not look up. I'm trying to look like right at you guys and not like that the whole time because I notice in past videos that I look up because um, I have the viewfinder on top. But yeah, I'm trying really hard to look directly at you guys. At you just got home from Target. I am actually low right now, so I'm gonna have a little snack before I eat lunch, even though I'm eating lunch right now. But I'm eating like a pretty low carb lunch. Um, I'm 65, so I'm just gonna have let me show you what I'm gonna have some of these energy chews. Um, they are 24 carbs, so like the perfect amount. I love these because, like. This is them, they're that thin. And I just throw a bunch in my bag and then I'm pretty good for low. Sometimes I only eat like three of them. So only 12 carbs, it depends on what I am. But I find that they work really well and really quickly. So I'm gonna make my lunch now. I'm actually, I was gonna make um, leftovers cause that's what I usually eat. But um, I'm gonna eat tuna because my dinner last night was a complete fail. I usually call myself like a chef, which I like am, I'm an at home chef, but yeah, last night was a complete fail and I just ended up having a bowl of quinoa that is all I ate. Um, so I'm going to make some tuna with um, some light mayo and throw some sriracha in there and then just eat it with a couple chips. Um, and that's the perfect amount of protein to hold me over till tonight. It's one o'clock now. And that's basically it. My blood sugar is 132 now, so I kind of jumped up a lot. So I'm gonna take some insulin um now yeah also because i'm gonna eat now and that's it i'll show how i make my lunch so light mayo sriracha there it is <laughs> sriracha not a ton but just enough about a tablespoon So, for reference, add about that much. Okay, these are the chips that I like to eat. They are Food oh, Should Taste Good brand. They're a multi-green chip and they are super good in this and also really good if you dip it in hummus. So I finished lunch and I actually ended up eating some hummus with my lunch. This is hummus that I made. It is buffalo hummus. It is so, 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 so good. I've been trying to eat this because I've had it um, for a little less than two weeks. Tomorrow, Friday will be two weeks. So I've been trying to eat this before it goes bad and I'm so close to being done. It is literally so good. It's so easy to make your own hummus. I highly suggest it. I'm actually gonna probably have to 
start looking for another recipe. I don't think I'll make more hummus today, but I'm gonna start looking for another recipe to make for when I'm out of this stuff. And then um, I just have these containers that I keep it in. Um, they are very handy. This was literally full and now it's not. And I also like hummus because it's pretty low carb if you don't eat a ton of it at one time. I think there's two carbs per, two carbs for one tablespoon of chickpeas. Um, so obviously there's like a whole can, not in here, but in the container and a half that I had. And yeah, really good, really healthy, super good with those chips that I just ate my lunch with. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna try and make it to dinner now without eating a snack. Sometimes at about 4.30, 4 o'clock, 4.30, I get a little hungry. We'll see if I get hungry. It'll be a test. And my blood sugar hasn't really done anything. I'm kind of going down, so I feel like I might go low. I'm 125. Who knows? It is 4.20. I am 70 going low. You can't really even see that. But I am eating another one of these things now in red. I ate blue earlier um, to get me up because I'm still working. I'm actually having a lot of computer trouble today. So that's kind of throwing me for a loop. So I'm just eating one of these. And I'm actually gonna start cooking dinner soon, but not just yet. I'm about to start meal prep, meal prepping, prepping my dinner. It's 5.30, I'm making um, a zucchini noodle like burrito thing. Um, so I have to spiralize the zucchini. I have my recipe on my iPad here that I just kind of messed up. Um, basically what's in this recipe is zucchini, onions, ground beef, um, a bunch of spices, corn, tomatoes, but I didn't buy tomatoes because I actually hate them. Um, so no tomatoes, enchilada sauce, enchilada sauce, I feel like I said that not the right way. Um, beans, it's just like literally, it's burrito zoodles. I'm really excited, I love zucchini, so I'm like oh, so excited. And I like spiralizing my own zucchini because one, it's cheaper, two, it's fun, and that's it. It's cheap and it's fun. Oh, also, this is like super low carb. I don't think this has like any carbs in it. Um. Yeah, nothing in here has carbs. That's the other nice thing about zucchini is it has no carbs. So I don't even know if I'm gonna have to take insulin. Also, I was a little high, so I took insulin for my high. So if I come down the way that I wanted to, I won't have to take any insulin. Oh wow, this is like the perfect, I should remember this. This is a really good angle for when I'm sitting down. Um, anyway, here's, my dinner. It is not cute at all. Um, and it looks like a really large portion, but what I should say is, one, I live alone. Two, one, I live alone so I don't have anyone to share this with, so I don't wanna waste it. Two, this is probably the last thing I'll eat because um, it has a lot of protein in it, so I don't think I'll be hungry later unless I like go for a walk or something. Sometimes that makes me a little hungry. So um, yeah, I think this is it. It's six o'clock, it's kind of early. I actually might get hungry later, but this will be a good test. See if I do. I wish I had a piece of like garlic bread or something to put next to it so it looked a little more inviting, but it's just a plate of food. So yeah, so I'm gonna eat this and then I'm gonna see what my blood sugar does in the next like two hours, so by eight o'clock. Right now, I'm 77 with one arrow down, so hopefully this will keep me from going low. It's not a lot of fast-acting carbs, so I may have to have something else. But, I'm excited to eat it. I feel like I should taste test it on the camera. Here's a teeny tiny little bit. It's good. <laughs> Here's my plate. I ate it all. So, without having to spill, <laughs> these are all the leftovers. Um, I probably won't eat all of this tomorrow. Um, I'll probably eat only half of it, but that's gonna be my lunch. So bing, bing, boom. Oh my God, this is like really freaking full. So it's about an hour after I've eaten, eaten? It's about an hour after I ate my dinner. I don't know what the correct verbiage of that is. Um, I'm actually gonna start editing this video because I'm not, I'm full and I wanna eat dessert, but I'm not gonna eat dessert yet. I think I'm gonna let myself get like a little hungry and have that be like a snack later. That's basically where I'm at, that's an update. Um, my blood sugar is 104, <laughs> sideways, arrow, you can't even see that. And yeah, I'm also gonna drink water. I've been kind of slacking. I had one at dinner, one of these at dinner, and I think I'm gonna start another one. 
It is 7.20 right now. I've just been editing the video. Whoa, got my mouse is not over there. Like the good little YouTuber that I am. Um, and I just looked at my Dexcom to see what my blood sugar was. And I am 131 with a diagonal arrow up. So I am gonna take a little bit of insulin. I think the protein is um, starting to spike me a little bit. Um, so I'm gonna take a little bit of Fiesp. I'm not gonna take Novolog because Fiesp works a little quicker. You know what I just realized? As I was doing that injection is all day today, I've only, okay, concentration. I've only injected in my left side, my left side. I haven't done any on my right side, which is really bizarre. And I have no idea why I'm doing that. I think I think that you can see better on this side than on this side, when in reality, does it matter? No. But I guess that's the life that I've chosen today. I've decided to call it quits on editing the video tonight. It is 8.30. After taking insulin, my blood sugar is 113, so well, I won't show you because you can't even see it. Um, I am glad I took a little bit of insulin, but I am going to try and get my steps in. Um, I walked around a little tiny bit, and I can tell you how many steps I have in a second. As of 8.33 p.m. on November, wow, it's not November, on January 30th, I have 6,957 steps, so I'm gonna do some laps around my apartment. It's the perfect size for that. I sometimes end up doing this, and I'm gonna try and get 3,000 steps in, which I think I can do it. I'm also gonna, okay, there's sirens going by. I'm also gonna try and watch a episode of The Real Housewives of New Jersey. So, gonna multitask, wish me luck. I'll let you know if I get low. And I still haven't had a snack yet, but it's about two and a half hours after dinner. I'm feeling good. So I've hit 10,000 steps. I walked all around my apartment about a thousand times, 10,000 times. Um, let me tell you, let me tell you the exact amount of steps I have. I'm laughing because I'm at 10,064 steps. So I'm just over the hump. Um, my blood sugar is on a little bit of the low side. It's like in the 80s. So I'm just having a snack, having these chips again, tortilla chips. And I think I'm gonna finish off my hummus. There's like nothing left, so I'm gonna eat that. Um, I'm gonna do that, watch a little bit of TV, and then eventually go to bed. I have one more thing I'm gonna do for sure, and I will show you what that is in a minute. It's my secret superpower. I'm gonna call it that. <laughs> the hummus. I tried to scrape every last little bit out of here. It's gone. Um, that hummus was so good. I'll link the recipe below. It's just buffalo hummus. So it's like a little spicy, really good, really, really, really easy to make. You literally just need a food processor and the ingredients. Um, I'm gonna have one more snack before bed. These are the tiny little cookie dough bites. They're so good. They have all healthy ingredients in them. There's, a, well, I'll link it below, but they're so good. They're so healthy. Protein powder's in here. Um, and... That's pretty much it. I'm gonna eat two of these before I go to bed. There's my blood sugar. Whoop. It's just like a little too low for where I wanna be before I go to sleep. So that's why I'm eating these guys. I do wanna say that I think these have about 10 carbs a piece. So I'm done eating these, I had two. And now my secret little thing that I do almost every night. I travel with it too. I'm actually, I'm gonna put my camera down. This is my secret weapon. Okay, so it's emergency. Oh wait, please hold, I have to change the battery. I almost made it through the day with this battery, but it is dying. This is Emergen Z instead of Emergen C. Um, so it is basically the same thing, but it has melatonin in it. It's a nighttime sleep aid with melatonin, plus vitamin C and other key antioxidants to fortify your body while you sleep. This stuff will knock you out in like a half an hour. It's so good. I fall asleep so quickly every night. It's about 10 o'clock right now. I'll probably be asleep by 11.15. Like a sleep out cold, not just like laying around in my bed twiddling my thumbs like I usually am. I am going to link this below. I take this with me when I travel, um, especially going to different time zones where they like completely screw you up. This is a lifesaver because you can go to bed early or at whatever time. Um, especially if you have an early day the next day. Also, complete random side note, I'm, instead of using this like silicone straw for this, just cause it's hard to like stir it, I am gonna use a smaller like plastic straw. <laughs> it's 
So it just makes it way easier to stir and all the little clumps get stirred up much quicker. Um, again, I always have this before I go to sleep. It works every time. I swear it works better than like the melatonin pill. So if you have any trouble sleeping, I 120 million five percent recommend this stuff. While I'm here in my kitchen where I end all the vlogs, I think I'm gonna end this video, or end all the vlogs, or end all the videos. I'm gonna end this one. I hope you guys like this video. Let me know if you want me to do, um, whoa more videos like this i just got a ton of notifications more videos like of like this of like what i eat in a day or just more vlogs maybe more day in the life i was thinking it would be kind of fun to do a like what i eat in the day and see how my blood sugars react with like a lot of carby meals so you can kind of see that um that'll be a little hard because i haven't been eating carbs lately that'll just be different or let me know in the comments what other type of videos you want to see let me know in the comments if you like this video see you guys later don't forget to follow me on instagram do all the things subscribe turn on notifications like this video it all helps me out a ton have a good night have a good day have a good week see you later bye